So peeps, another day, another job. And this Myron gearbox has come in. We're gonna be testing the insulation resistance test across the vines. And also a cheeky little resistance check. See if we're all going on. Now with the, these links in Delta, we're gonna be removing these for any testing. So my little party sausage fingers are gonna be shown in the windings. And then down to earth. That's where we're going to be testing to first. Now us engineers, we like our colours and our crayons. So here's a little visual on the windings. And then a cut-in three-phase motor. This is just showing you what's inside. Now the first test, we're going to be checking the insulation between the windings. So we're going around to insulation test. And we normally want about double the voltage it handles. The crocodile clip down to earth. Now we're going to be checking across the three windings. Now what we want is north of 100 mega ohms. Also a balance across the three windings. So here we go, we've got 550 mega ohms. That's uh, in the excellent. And then the next we're going to be going across the windings. See if we've got any breakdown between them. So first two you'll see 550 mega ohms. And then the last one will be end to end on the windings. So that'll be down, that'll be short. Now we're going to be doing the resistance across the all three windings. Now in an industrial setting, we're going to be looking about normally about 1%. We want no change in the free windings of that. So balance across them. So as long as they're balanced, we're good to go. Now that's approved.